Blake Arthur here for sports on a Monday here at Palm Desert High School because what a weekend it was for Aztec athletics. In fact, it all happened within a matter of hours and it started Saturday night right here about 530. The Palm Desert boys soccer team continuing their historic season. CIF champions in Division 5 as they took down Animo leadership 3-1 the final. The Aztecs going to continue their season with a game right here on Tuesday. That's tomorrow, 5 o'clock, and they're going to be hosting Bishops out of La Jolla. We, of course, have the coverage for you then. So that's the soccer team, but cannot forget about the Palm Desert wrestling team. They were at the state tournament in Bakersfield, and they came back with two state champions, Daniel Herrera, the big fella, 285, back-to-back -back champ, and, of course, Bo Mantanona, the superstar, 152 champion. He's the number one. 152 in the entire country. He's, of course, going to Michigan, and what a career it's been for Bo Mancinona and Herrera. Had the chance to catch up with both of them on Monday afternoon. I just want to win, you know, so I'm, I'm going out there and doing whatever I can to get my hand raised. Oh, it felt great, you know, it's just I've been working hard for this for a long time, four years, you know, but this has been my, my number one goal, you know, and it just feels great to finally get that one on, get that monkey off my back. I mean, I knew that I had what it takes to win the match. I just had to go do it. And I try not to put too much pressure on myself just because it was, you know, it was my last match. It was like, I just want to have fun out there, get it done, you know, see what I can do. It was a great moment and, and awesome. I got to share it with my, you know, my brother and my dad. You know, my last high school match, maybe one of the last times I'll be coached by them. So, you know, I, I try to take it all in. Um, it was more of like a relief, I think, you know, because we knew he deserved it the whole time. And it was just to actually get it done is, uh, it felt really good. It was a long time coming. Honestly, I was more happy for him than I was for myself. That's, I really love that kid. You know, we've been through it all since he's really been, him and his family have been a part of my journey since I started this whole thing. So to see him finally get what he deserves, it's just surreal, you know. You've yet to lose a high school wrestling match in your career. <laughs> Have you thought about how incredible that is? I haven't really given much thought about it. Like during season, I don't really pay attention to it. But like after season, it's been really like sits in. Like like yesterday, it sunk in with me. Like what like I've done so far and how good I've been. You know, it's just amazing. Think about it. So as I said at the top, what a historic special weekend for Palm Desert Athletics, the boys soccer team, CIF champs in Division 5, and of course the wrestling team with two state champions. Going to go down in the history books here on Cook Street. Reporting on Cook Street, Blake Arthur, News Channel 3.